And today in this meditation, self-healing with love, we will work with the energy of love for self-healing. The healing can be on a physical, mental, emotional, or spiritual level. I've used this meditation to heal my torn rotator cuff and my knee injury, my lower backache, extreme stomach pain, colds, and more. Keep in mind that energy flows with intention. State your intention to yourself right now as to what you want to heal. So let's begin by getting yourself into a comfortable position either sitting or lying down. If you tend to fall asleep during guided meditation, you might want to sit up instead of lying down. But just know that even if you fall asleep, this type of meditation still has an effect. The work is still being done. I'm speaking directly to your subconscious mind. That is where your limiting beliefs and difficult life experiences hide out becoming activated without your conscious mind being aware, creating the circumstances that brought about the injury to begin with. And this is where the healing occurs. It's within your subconscious mind. So even if you don't recall what took place during the meditation, your subconscious mind is getting it all and the work is being done. So let's begin. Take a nice, slow, deep healing breath in and gently let it out. And as you're doing this, I'd like you to think of an area in your life. It can be physical, emotional, spiritual, whatever it is for you that needs healing. And take another deep cleansing healing breath in Again, letting it out slowly. And if you're not sure what it is that needs healing, maybe you just feel down, depressed, something's off. You just don't know why. But just allow your higher self, your wise mind, your wise all-knowing mind, to show you the pictures or send you a thought about something to work with. And take another deep, cleansing, healing breath in. Again, letting it out softly, slowly. Really relaxing your body. Feeling relaxed. Letting go. Let your thoughts about this situation flow to you now. Look at them. Listen to them. Really allowing them. And take in another deep breath. Only this time, hold it for six seconds. And then let it all the way out. Just feeling your breath travel through you. Calming you, relaxing you taking you to a beautiful place of relaxation where you can work with your higher self and with the energy of love for self-healing. And right now, I'd like you to imagine that there's this beautiful spiritual sun above your head, this golden glowing light above you, warming you. This is the spiritual sun. It is the light of the universe. It is this amazing energy that is flowing to you and through you always. And what we're going to do now is to draw in this beautiful energy, this beautiful universal love energy, this energy of pure positive love. Love is the highest energy there is. Love alongside of joy, peace, appreciation, and gratitude. Feel that light of the spiritual sun now flowing down through your crown chakra, through the top of your head. This is your spiritual center. 
This light is just calming your mind, relaxing you, flowing down through to your third eye chakra, that area between your eyes and the center of your head at the level of your ears. This is where your intuition flows. Creativity grows. And now, flowing down around your eyes, this light is just releasing and relaxing all the little muscles, allowing your clear vision to flow, insights to flow. And this beautiful light is now flowing down into your jaw, relaxing your jaw, flowing down to your neck, into your throat chakra, clearing and allowing you to communicate, and flowing into your shoulders, just relaxing you. You might even drop your shoulders a little bit lower, softer, feeling this beautiful light flowing down into your arms, your elbows, forearms, your hands. This light is flowing down into your heart chakra, filling your heart center with this pure, positive love energy of the universe, allowing your heart to expand even more. And now flowing into your solar plexus chakra, your power center, going through your abdomen, into your sacral chakra, through to your hips, to the bottom of your spine at your root chakra, your manifestation center. This light is aligning all of your chakras, allowing more flow of energy throughout your whole body. Feeling this beautiful light flowing through your hips, to your thighs, your knees, your calves, ankles, and out through your feet, going deep into Mother Earth, grounding you to Mother Earth. And now also, imagining this pure love energy coming up from Mother Earth, flowing up through your body, intertwining with the light from the spiritual sun, flowing gently up, through all your chakras, sending warm pulsations of love all throughout your whole body as it makes its way up and connects with the spiritual sun. Your whole body is being bathed in pure love, pure positive energy, universal energy. Feel the love, feel the calm, Feel the peace that this light brings. And now, with the assistance of this love energy that is flowing through you, connecting you with your higher self, your wise mind, it's time to take a good look at this situation that is causing you pain that is creating sickness, that is affecting your well-being. Allow your higher self to assist you at looking at what is contained within this pain or within this feeling. See if you can locate this pain or this upset in your body. Feel it in your body if it's physical, it will be easy to find. If it's emotional, just feel where it is in your body. Where do you sense any tightness? Does it rest in your gut, in your head, in your throat? What part of you feels pain or feels stuck in some way? A feeling where energy is stuck or trapped or just not flowing freely. Sense this area of your body. Allow the images or thoughts to flow from your wise mind right to you. 
ask, what is needed for you to look at in this moment, to take a look at right now? I'll be quiet as you connect with your wise mind and see what it is that it wants to tell you about this situation. And now, if you have found this area in your body, or even if you're not sure where it is, I want you to connect with your wise mind, that all-knowing part of you, and ask if there's a message for you in this pain, in this discomfort. For there is always a message there. Allow it to flow to you. Listen to your wise mind. Look at the pictures that it is showing you. The feelings that it is bringing to you. The memory that might be coming. And see what this pain or feeling is trying to tell you. What is it trying to teach you? Now, it might not be the obvious thing that you think it is. And yet, it just might be. Try not to think hard about it. Just let any messages or pictures flow. They will be the right ones to work with at this time. Trust your wise mind. It knows. So I want you to step back, get out of your own way, pull back your left brain analyzing mind, and allow your wise mind to tell you what it knows about this situation. That part of you that is intuition, the right brain creative part of you, that part that is so connected to universal energy. Let it show you what to look at. And I will remain quiet while you connect. You might have thoughts come to you. You might have pictures come to you. You may hear your wise mind's voice speaking to you. You might not make the connection until later on. But for now, just take another deep breath in. Gently letting it out. Really allowing yourself to take this moment of connection with your wise mind. And to find out what this pain or upset is trying to tell you. Because there is always a message. There is always something to learn. Something to look at. And then something to be released. And that is the beautiful, magical part of the process. Looking at it. Accepting it. Truly accepting it. And then simply letting it go. This is your time now, right now, in this present moment. To look at and learn from the situation. Okay. Now what I want you to do is to breathe deeply into this area that came up for you. And as you breathe out, I want you to imagine this blockage, this belief, this sickness, this stuck energy is releasing and breaking up into tiny particles, leaving your body, leaving your mind, 
leaving with your out breath. Your higher self, your soul is with you and assisting you as you work with your breath, releasing this energy that no longer serves you. Just by breathing deeply into the situation, you can break it up and release it. It's just energy. It needs to flow. And where it is stuck, you can break it up and let it go. Release it. We will do this three times. Just breathing deeply into the situation. And then with a strong out breath, you'll be breaking up that stuck energy and dispersing it out into the universe to be transmuted back into pure positive energy. And now, one, taking in that deep breath, hold it, and now blow strongly through that stuck energy, breaking it up into tiny particles. And two, take in another deep, loving breath in and again hold it. And now blow out strongly through that energy, breaking it up, releasing it with your breath. You do not want it. You no longer need it. And so three, one more very deep breath in holding it and now letting it all the way out and just sit for a moment just feeling the release feel it at a cellular level maybe you feel tingling Maybe you feel lighter, looser. Maybe it was like a whoosh, a whoosh that went through your body, like energy moving out through your skin from the inside out, a sort of buzz throughout your body. Just sit with this feeling, whatever it is for you, for a moment, basking in the release acknowledging it and allowing it to leave letting it flow watching it disperse away out into the universe and now for my favorite part I would like you to imagine that where that energy was Feel for yourself if it's 100% gone or if it's 75% gone, 50%, 25%, 10% gone. Whatever you feel, just trust what you feel. Trust that your wise mind is telling you Take notice of it, feel it in your body, and whether it is all gone, or mostly gone, or partially gone, what I want for you to do now is to imagine that you have this unlimited crew of little smiley face Pac-Men, little smiley faces that are going into the area, flooding the area, and cleaning it up, gobbling up any pieces left over, any little pieces of that energy, that energy that was stuck, just loosening it up, eating it away, cleaning it out. What was once there is now gone. And here comes the best part. We're now going to flood that area again, only this time with love. 
Imagine these tiny hearts. I call them pack women. Little pink hearts with big, beautiful lips, kissing the whole area. Kiss, 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 kissing every bit of the area, flooding the area with love. Love is the energy that heals all. Sending love to any situation that is causing you some sort of pain, physical, emotional, whatever it might be, flooding that area with love is how we heal it. Find whatever visual works best for you. Maybe it's little surgeons, a mini construction crew, fairies, angels, or little Pac-Men and women. Whatever way you have to send love into the area is all that is needed. So now, I'd like you to thank your crew. Thank those Pac-Men and women. Thank your wise mind for working with you today, for assisting you in seeing what it is that needed more love, that needed healing. Feel the release you just had, release of unwanted energy, and the return of more love, filling that area that was needing this love. Take this feeling of love, remember it, and send it to yourself at any point during your day. Take a minute. Connect to this feeling of love and soak it in. A daily dose of love is what your soul, your higher self, your mind has to send you, wants to send you. Just connect and feel and allow the love. All you need to do is ask. And it's there. It's always there. And so now, I'd like you to start gently returning to this time and space, to the room that you're in, to the chair that you're sitting in, to the here and now. And at the count of three, just opening your eyes, taking notice of how anything feels different within you, how things seem a little brighter, or you feel a little lighter. Acknowledge yourself for the work that you've just done in healing yourself. You are a very powerful person and you can heal yourself. You just did. One. Two. And three. Wide awake and ready to go. Go and create the life you dream of living. Feeling awesome as you do. You can return to this meditation as often as you like as often as you feel drawn. And I'm sending you love and light, and I hope that you've enjoyed this meditation. And just know, you've got the power.